Am I the asshole for refusing to answer door for husband's parcel deliveries? I work nights. I've always worked days but this recent job change means I'm now in all day and at work all night. It also means I'm asleep during the day. I only work three days a week. Husband has started ordering parcel after parcel because I'm now at home to sign for them. Problem is he never tells me he is expecting one and he never orders it to arrive on my days off, it's always Amazon next day. This morning was the last straw for me. I had only been asleep two hours when the door went. Ran downstairs like a madwoman in my pajamas. Yep was another parcel for him. Am I the asshole if I refuse to get up for his parcels when I'm on my shift days? I've had a chat with him almost every week as I'm exhausted and no such luck. Not the asshole. He can collect them or reschedule delivery. Not the asshole. Screw that. Working nights is brutal. And being continually woken up sucks. Put a note over the doorbell saying that you work nights and are sleeping and to re-deliver on XX day. He will not die if he has to wait an extra day or two to receive a delivery. If he won't take your sleep schedule into account, you need to take control of the situation. FYI, he's super inconsiderate and rude for expecting you to give up sleep to sign for a package. They are large parcels always too big to go through post box. So for Amazon we have to open the door and take it and then they sign the handheld machine thing. As due to COVID we can't at moment. If we don't physically open door and take it it goes back in truck. Sorry should have explained that better in post. I'm in the UK so parcels are not left on doorsteps. Not the asshole. He's being inconsiderate. Not the asshole. He was coping fine before when you were at work. And if he still refuses to see you're not available now, wake him up when he's sleeping and see how he likes it. Not the asshole, so I'm a nurse and work a shift pattern. My partner also orders a lot off of Amazon. He doesn't expect me to answer the door though if I'm sleeping. If anything I turn off the doorbell, it's wireless, and hang a sign in the window instructing the postie not to knock or ring bell as there's a night shift worker sleeping. If anyone knocks I just ignore them and continue to sleep. Once I misplaced my window sign and my partner made a makeshift sign out of cardboard and cello taped it to our letterbox saying not to wake me, he didn't tell me he made the sign, I just noticed it later in the day and it made me smile, he knows how much I need that sign. OMG no, you are not the asshole. I'd be livid if my husband did that for anything that wasn't absolutely essential exception. To do it regularly for unessential shit is super disrespectful to you and could actively put you in danger if your job involves safety critical tasks like driving or operating machinery. Even if it doesn't, you're likely to find it harder if you're tired, so you're less effective and more likely to make mistakes. Just know. Wait, if he has Amazon two-day delivery, that means you have Prime. Prime has a feature called Prime Delivery Day. You choose a day of the week and they deliver all packages on that day. Problem solved. And not the asshole. Not the asshole. Can't he get his parcels delivered to work? Not the asshole. Kind of weird you have to sign for Amazon packages. We order from Amazon all of the time and never have to sign. Can he get it delivered to an Amazon locker and he can pick it up after work? Not the asshole. Have his parcels delivered to his work? Info. Why do the packages need to be signed for? What is he ordering? Not the asshole. Sleep deprivation is used as torture. Sure, when it is used deliberately, it is far more intense than this. Yet, it points out how much stress it can add to the body. Getting two hours of sleep, waking up with adrenaline pumping, having one to two hours before you manage to fall asleep again, is genuinely dangerous for your health in the longer run. I genuinely suspect that a huge part of that night shift workers has more health issues as cause their surroundings don't give a shit. Not the asshole, you have Prime so he could just order them the day before it's her day off. Just don't get the parcel and he will quickly realize that er not fkn around, or wake him up three hours into him sleeping every day to see how he feels. Not the asshole but if you want to be, you should see if you could get some friends to knock on your door and ring your doorbell at all hours of the night. Sorry, op forgot her lunch, you're home so she said you wouldn't mind me getting it for her. Op needs this important document. Thank goodness you're here during the night so I could drop by and retrieve it for her. It'll be glorious. Edit. Or take the dog to work with you. Your husband's a really inconsiderate asshole to continuously knowingly fuck with you and the dog. Get alarms. Set them to go off at different hours. And hide them all over the house.
He'll get the point sooner or later. Not the asshole. Make him stick to your schedule. Amazon next day makes it really easy. Hash promoted. Not the asshole. If you live together, he should tell you when he's ordering stuff. And also you do not need to be running around doing anything for him. Not the asshole and why the FNARK is he so disrespectful to you. Not the asshole you wouldn't expect him to get up in the middle of the night. Not the asshole. As a long time night shifter, I'll tell you, it took a long time for people to realize that 1 p.m. for them, is 1 a.m. for me. When they're living, I'm sleeping, and that if I have to work or just got off work, I'm still in night mode and won't be very responsive. You should sit down and explain to him that just because you are physically home, it doesn't mean you want to keep getting woken up just to accept packages. If he's doing it more freely specifically because, you're home to receive them, then it hasn't clicked that you're trying to sleep. If he still doesn't get it, then on your nights off just start ringing the doorbell every few hours until he wakes up, and explain in the morning that is the same exact concept, and say or night it's pretty crummy to have your precious sleep disturbed. Not the asshole if it's Amazon he's mostly ordering from he can schedule all his deliveries on one specific day. No need to order one item every day. IDK if that would solve the issue entirely but could help. Not the asshole my wife and I are both doctors who regularly work nights. We have a strict system with parcels, as soon as you get home a note is put up on the door asking deliveries not to buzz. We're lucky that we're in flats so they're fairly safe to be left at the front door but if it needs a signature it won't be collected until a waking day. Talk to your husband and explain how precious night shift sleep is. If he still does it then keep ordering pizzas to him throughout the night. Tell the pizza shop you're a bit desfuck and they need to knock loud. He'll soon understand. Not the asshole. You have days off and with Amazon he could easily schedule the deliveries then. It's not very considerate of him. I only advise you actually have a conversation about it before losing it om him. I'll talk a it would understandable. Not the asshole. Turn the doorbell off. Night shifts are hard. Sleep during the day is never as restful as it is. You really don't need the extra interruption. It doesn't sound it would be a big hustle for him to order his deliveries for another day and you already told him how disturbing it is for you. It's very inconsiderate of him. How would he like it, if you called him several times during your night shift because he's home? Refuse them, so he will change his behavior, you gave him fair warning. You wouldn't be an asshole but if you're already up and refuse it's pretty petty. Speaking as a night worker that sacrifices sleep a lot for wife and kids. When he leaves for work. Put a sign on your door saying. Night shift worker asleep. Do not ring bell. Please do not disturb. Not the asshole. He could stand to learn that there are people in the world with schedules that differ from his own. Not the asshole. This is so selfish. How are you meant to function without proper sleep? Sleep is so important to our health and well-being, and it's well documented that lack of quality sleep impairs cognitive ability. Can you get a lockbox out the front that he can get packages stored in? That way he can order what he wants without disturbing you. Start calling him in the middle of every time he gets a deliver, let understand. Not the asshole. Start calling your husband in the middle of the night when he's asleep, and ask if there's going to be a package the next day. My hubby is forever ordering parcels and I can often be a day sleeper due to disabilities. We ended up getting something like this imager.com slash a slash hw5 wood closing parenthesis. Not the asshole. I work nights and love it but people often seem to forget that night shift means you need to sleep during the day. My other half didnt realize how important that sleep is until they switch to night shift too. If he won't be reasonable and continues to order packages for you to sign for just ignore it and sleep. Earplugs or noise cancelling headphones can help block the noise from the doorbell if you can't turn it off. A sound machine could also help. If you haven't yet pick up some blackout curtains or a good eye mask, it makes a big difference as far as sleep quality. Not the asshole and if hubby refuses to stop and you are awake all night all nights off start making noise, blaring music two hours into his sleep. Give him a taste of his own medicacine. I work nights myself but I have a toddler and an understanding husband. I sleep for approx. 1.5 to 2 hours during daytime and for 4 to 4.5 hours when husband gets home unless like today I go in early I will get 3 rolling on the floor laughing I get quality time with hubby on days off and weekends. 
Wait, so you've spoken to your husband about this but he keeps ordering more? Or you've spoken to him about it but ones he previously ordered are still coming? You haven't told us what your husband said in your chat to him. YTA I work nights and I've never once gotten out of bed to answer the doorbell. I have my house locked up and let anyone who is ringing my doorbell assume I'm at work. Is it possible for him to get his things delivered to an Amazon locker? He won't have to wait any longer for it. Just go and pick it up at his convenience. I work nights and I've used it a lot. Can you just ignore it? The delivery services in my area would just leave the packages on my front porch if no one is home or no one answers the door. The only time they'd not deliver is if the package had to be signed for, per sender's request, alcohol orders etc. I'd just ignore the doorbell and take the packages in when I wake up if I were you. Not the asshole. I've had to work during the night and it's really tough once you get sleep deprived. Greater than I've had a chat with him almost every week as I'm exhausted and no such luck. You've tried being reasonable. The only option left to you is to put your foot down and tell him that any deliveries that wake you up will be going straight into the dustbin. No warnings, no discussion, no questions, just straight in the bin. Absolutely not the asshole. I suggest you set an alarm on your husband's phone for 3 a.m. and 4 a.m. to wake him up and ask him to get out of bed and open the front door. Clearly he is having trouble conceptualizing what it's like to work nights. That might help. Not the asshole. If you want to get super petty, arrange for a willing friend to deliver packages addressed to you to your house in the middle of the night. On multiple occasions, make sure the contents of said packages would be in no way of benefit to him. Jesus fucking Christ. I see shit like this all the time on these subs. Has everyone just become a bunch of self-absorbed, entitled, thoughtless pricks? That should have been done once, then explain that it interrupts your sleep then don't do it again. Maybe he dies it again out of habit but then never does it again. Not the asshole. He's doing this on purpose. Are you able to log into the Amazon account? If so, check it on a daily basis for a while. There is a place to say where to place packages without knocking. If not, see if you can reschedule or even cancel it. If all else fail, don't answer the door. After he doesn't get his packages after a while, he'll think more about it. Not the asshole. Not the asshole the cheek of it. Dot. You are not his click and collect service. They have that for a reason. Tell him to address the parcel there or to an Amazon locker, then simply don't answer and let them drive away with it. It would totally serve him right. Other options. Put a sign on the door saying, deliveries please call, his work number. This could be for any reason, e.g. disability, it doesn't imply you're not in. Do you not have a joint Amazon account or his password? Go in and change the address to click and collect yourself. Open the door and play absolutely dumb. This isn't for me, it must be a mistake, please take it away. Sign for it and leave it outside your door. I really wish it was a less reputable company delivering so you could get one over on him. The one time I've ever had something delivered when I was out, it was Hermes, and they put it next to our bin so it was taken out with the rubbish. Your husband totally needs that to happen to him. Not the asshole, you need sleep. You work and you need sleep to live. You cannot work while sleeping at the same time. If you work during the night then you need to sleep during the day. If he can't grasp that concept then hide alarm clocks around all set to different times on one of his own work nights. He would be pissed off, but what he's doing to you is exactly the same thing. Not the asshole. Unhook your doorbell. I seriously don't understand why more people don't do it. So much more peaceful. Do you have to sign for them? Not the asshole. Change default delivery to an Amazon pickup location. Let him know where his packages will be going unless he wants them to sit on the porch until he's home. Let him know you will disable the doorbell, and put a sign on the door. Do not knock it will wake baby. I have a insert breed, maybe pitbull, and am not afraid to use it. And then let him know if his package is stolen, it's because he didn't listen to you. Then either listen to nature music or something as you sleep, to drown out possible knocking. Earplugs, don't answer the door and then tell your husband to screw his head on the right way. Amazon usually have collection points at local convenience store. Get him to direct his parcels there.